everybody. Don and Grandma here with an Amazon haul. I got an Amazon package today. And I ordered this stuff off of Amazon, like I say. Let me find my notes. Okay, I will list everything down in the description box below. So if you're interested in any of these items, they come from Amazon. I did purchase these items myself. So they did come from Amazon. The first thing I got was I have told y'all I like the 28 grid peel boxes. Well, I got a six pack off of Amazon, y'all, which would end up being 168 slots. But I got a six pack of the 28 grid peel boxes for $12.99, which would make them $2.17 a piece. I thought that was a great deal because it's the colored ones. It's the ones that I like, that Sweet Tea has got me turned on to. Comes with stickers, but I got them. And uh, the reason why I got them, I don't need no storage. I don't need no storage. Y'all know I've got, but y'all, I have got a bunch of storage, but I have got them all kitted up. They're all in use right now. I've got them all kitted up. And I needed something to kit up some Christmas in because this is a six pack of Christmas. <laughs> I did not have, I didn't think enough Christmas canvases to last me during the month of uh, July. And I'm sure six eight of them ain't gonna last long either because I usually do one a day or one in a day and a half, so. But like I say, I don't work and I have plenty of time to do that because I tend to my mother, caregiver for her. But these are the colored ones. And like I say, I got a six pack and I think $2.17 a piece for these are good. Diamond Paint with Sweet Tea. If y'all have not checked her out, check out Diamond Paint with Sweet Tea. She is the one that got me turned on to the colored peel boxes. And they do shut better. Now, I do have some clear ones, and I have found out the colored ones do shut better for me. And it may be all in my mind. I don't know, but I like the um, colored peel boxes. And I thought it was a good deal to get six for $12.99. So... I got them, so I'm going to kit up my Christmas kit and some of them so I can get that done. But like I say, it was $12.99, which would make them $2.17 a piece for uh, six of them, for a six pack. Okay, then I ordered, and it did come with the labels, y'all. Then I ordered a six pack of Christmas canvases. These are all 30 by 40s. It is a six pack and I gave $14.99 for the six pack, which would make them $2.50 a piece for 30 by 40s. They are round, which I thought was a good deal for that. Which was a good deal for that. And I have done opened them because my mother wants to look at them. I, when I get a package in out there, she always likes to look at them. So I open them for her to look at too. <laughs> oh, my. Anyway, regular tool kit. Like I say, round beads, pretty colors. But these was a six pack and I liked them. I liked the way they looked. These, this one looks kind of vintage to me. And I don't know if y'all know it or not. I like, I really like vintage Christmas. I think Debbie gets crafty. I think she said she liked vintage Christmas too. And y'all, it is hard to find vintage Christmas canvases and without them being an outrageous price. Let me put that in there. Cause I'm just not gonna pay. Y'all know I am cheap and I am not gonna pay no big price for a canvas. Y'all know that. And I know some of y'all probably say, well, I wish you wasn't so cheap. I'm sorry. You know, I try, I like to find a deal. I like to save y'all, help y'all find a deal. So if you're gonna do Christmas in July, you've got time to order these. 
This is the reason why I am showing it to you. Today is, um, what's today? Today is Thursday. So y'all will see this on Friday. That's the reason why I'm gonna go ahead and post this one as soon as I tape it for y'all. Because if you wanna do Christmas in July, you can probably get this pack and it not be but $2 and 50 cents a piece. So, here it is. Stick is good. This one has 20 colors. It does have DMCs. And here it is, y'all. It is a Christmas tree. Here is some of the drill, so y'all can see it. It is around, but I just thought it was just gorgeous. I, if you do not know about me, I usually don't celebrate Christmas too much no more because my daddy passed away back in 2011, I think it was, or 2012, I can't remember the exact year. But Christmas has not been the same for me. So this year, I'm getting to feel a little better. So I thought I would do it in July. I wanted to do Christmas in July. So, that's the reason why I ordered all these canvases. And if y'all want to do Christmas in July with me, by all means, y'all come on and do it with me. I would love for y'all to do it with me. It does not matter if you have a channel or not. If you do not have a channel, then you can email me a picture to my email. I have it down in the description box of every video I do is my email address and my address. So if y'all want to participate, email them to me because I would love to see them. All right, regular tool kit and regular bead. But if you have a channel, you can do your completions of your and your whipping chats for the month of July. You can do it in Christmas. We're doing Christmas in July. You can do as many as you want, or you can do just one, and that is fine. I do not have no strict rules on my Christmas in July. As long as it looks Christmas to you, you do it. I don't care if it's just snow and animals, whatever. Christmas in July, whatever Christmas means to you, I will put it that way. I do not care. I am not strict on nothing like that. You know, you do whatever Christmas means to you. If you see a canvas and it looks like Christmas to you, you do it. I am not putting no restrictions on nothing like that. I am just doing Christmas in July for fun. And I want y'all to join in with me. Because I would love to have y'all join in with me. I'm doing it whether anybody else does it or not. I'm doing Christmas in July. I don't ever, I did one Christmas canvas last year. One, one. And it was my pink Santa that Robin from Texas, hey Robin, got me. I did it last year and I didn't even do it in December. So, <laughs> but y'all, I love this Christmas tree because it definitely looks vintage to me. It just something about it. And I will probably dress some of these up. Y'all know how I am about my ABs and stuff and rhinestones. Y'all don't ever know what I'm gonna get or what I'm gonna do. But this one has 19 colors in it. And I think it's so pretty. These red balls right here would be so pretty to do them in rhinestones and the yellow and ABs. It would be gorgeous. And the white on it, has it got white on it? Nope, it don't have white. But anyway, so pretty. But this one, like I say, looked vintage to me, so I got it. And this one right here looks vintage to me. I really like this one too. I like the whole pack. I mean, I don't know why I'm saying I really like this one. And they're all round, y'all. All round. But this one really looks vintage to me. This one to me looks like a vintage post Christmas postage stamp. <laughs> and I love it. I do. I really do like it. But it does, it does look vintage postage stamp to me for Christmas. A Christmas vintage Christmas postage stamp. But this one has uh, 20 colors. It does have DMCs. Stick is good. And here it is, y'all. Tell me, does that not look vintage to y'all? I think it does. I think it looks like a vintage postage stamp. But I think it is so pretty. And like I say, y'all, this pack 
wouldn't but uh, $14.99, which would make them $2.50 a canvas. And even if you don't want to do them all for Christmas in July, you would have them for Christmas. I mean, it's just a good deal. But I got this six pack because I'll be working on Christmas in July. I ain't, I ain't gonna say I'll get all of the ones done that I've got done, which I'm sure I will because I don't have that much Christmas. Christmas is one thing I do not buy a lot of. But a lot of these did look kind of vintagey to me and that's the reason why I got them. But I love Christmas trees and I like snowmen. That is my two things and I do love the vintage Santa Claus looking. I love vintage looking stuff. I just can't help it. I do. And this little Santa does look kind of vintagey too. So I liked him and there's kitty cats. And it's, the rendering on this one may not turn out very good because it's, it's kind of busy on it. But this chickadee's gonna do it anyway and try to get it to where it will look good. But it looks good in the camera. Y'all look at this, is this not sweet? This does look kind of vintagey to me, the Santa Claus does, but it's got cats in the stockings. So diamond paint with sweet tea. <laughs> and who else is it? Is it, uh, who else likes cats? Is it, is it uh, Chris with Addicted to Diamond Painting? I can't remember who else it is. I know Miss Connie likes, Connie's this and that likes cats too. But I just thought, yeah, I just thought it was pretty. It's good, and like I say, this one has 19. This is a good little old pack for Christmas in July. I was just, I was excited when I found it because I thought it was a good price. Regular toolkit. All these beads do have the um, um, canvas code on them. But I just thought I had got a good pack off of Amazon for this price. And I wanted to show y'all, that's the reason why I'm posting this on Friday. So y'all will have time to order them and maybe can get them if y'all decide y'all want them for uh, Christmas in July. And plus it's a good deal, $2.50 per canvas. Can't beat that. As I say, you can't beat it with a stick. Can't beat it with a stick. This one right here has 20 colors in it. So cute. It is Santa and a reindeer. So cute. But the drill fields look good on them, y'all. Quality, I'm, I'm, I'm satisfied with the quality on them. They're budget friendly. Okay, and this last one, I like this one too. I liked all of them. I don't know why I say I like this one too. Y'all, looky here. This one is in bags. Nothing on it. So let me get a pen right now and write on here what canvas this is. So if y'all get up in bags, this one would already be done, but there's nothing wrote on it on which painting it goes to. This one right here, y'all, I think it's so cute. Somebody made a comment about the way I roll these canvases that they lay flatter for them. I'm proud, y'all. <laughs> I'm proud it does. it does for me. That's the reason why I do it the way I do it. And I stick them under some heavy stuff and get them to lay in flat. I got some patriotic ones. I'm laying flat now. I am going to do, now I am going to tell y'all this. Fourth of July is coming up. Y'all know that it falls in July. I will have patriotic on the fourth of July. I am going to do patriotic along with my Christmas in the month of July. I will just have them on the 4th of July day only. It will be the only day I have my patriotic 
19 colors in here. It does have the DMC codes, but y'all look at it. Is this not cute? Look at the two right there and the little red squirrel. <laughs> I just love it. So cute, so cute. But I wanted to hop on here and show y'all my Christmas canvases that I ordered. So that way, if y'all want to have a chance to get them, I'm gonna show them to y'all again. Here is the reindeer and squirrel. Santa and the reindeer. Santa and the kittens in the stocking. The vintage looking reindeer postage stamp. <laughs> My vintage Christmas tree. This one really does look vintage. And then this other Christmas tree. And like I say, this six pack was $14.99, which would make each canvas $2.50 a piece. So, that's that. And then, of course, the six pack of the 28 grid peel boxes, the multicolored ones, were $12.99 for the 12, uh, six pack, which would make them $2.17 a piece. So, anyway, I just wanted to hop on here. And y'all will be seeing this on Friday. Hope y'all have a great Friday. And that way I wanted to show y'all so that way it'd still be early enough so if you wanted to order them from July that y'all could get them from Amazon. And like I say, all these came from Amazon. I did purchase these myself. And the reason why I purchased this six pack is because I'm afraid I won't have enough canvases for Christmas. I do have a few that I've already gotten that I have unboxed and showed y'all. And I do have a big one, a... um diamond dots big one which is the horse with the uh ivy and berries the holly berries around its neck and stuff that i will be doing in that month too so but anyway thanks for stopping by if you like what you see hit the thumbs up button if you would like to be part of the diamond grandma family by all means hit that little bell it will upload anytime I put a video on so y'all won't miss it. I will put all this down in the description box below for y'all to have in case y'all are interested in getting it off of Amazon. And I hope everybody will join me for Christmas in July. It's just a fun event thing that I want to do just for fun. And like I say, there's no restrictions on any of the pictures. My thing is, if it looks like Christmas to you, do it. I'm not strict on nothing like that. You know, whatever Christmas. Christmas may mean something totally different to me than it does you. So you do what Christmas means to you. And I will leave it that way. It's whatever Christmas means to you. We are doing Christmas in July. So like I say, you do not have to have a channel. But if you have a channel, you can do your completions in July for Christmas in July. And uh, I just want to say thank you for stopping by again. Y'all come back and see me. Get on Amazon. Get y'all a six-pack of these containers and a six-pack of these um, um, canvases for Christmas. And y'all come back and see me tomorrow. I will be here. I love y'all. I hope you have a great Friday. I hope y'all stay cool. Watch your pets, your older people, and yourself. And stay safe out there. I love y'all. Come back and see me tomorrow.